What's up you guys, my name is Jesse and welcome to my channel. So for those that don't know, I own a 2001 Mazda 626 that I use as a little daily bucket like my little mechanic mobile. And ever since I purchased it, it's been making a really loud whiny noise like if I were to be cruising around with my girlfriend all the time. I usually ignore it and it goes away pretty fast. But lately, it's been getting longer, the noise, and it just, it's extremely loud. Like, let me show you guys how it sounds. <clears throat> yeah so it's kind of embarrassing to call myself a mechanic but yet i can't even fix my own personal car so i told myself today that i'll be replacing the belts and let me show you guys how it's done so let's get to it loosen the top power steering pump bolt you don't have to remove the bolt Next, loosen the bottom bolt. It's a tight fit. Use a wrench. Remove the cooling reservoir hose so it won't be in the way. Loosen the bolt going through the tensioner in front of the power steering pump. Pull the power steering belt to release the tension. Then turn the belt sideways and move it around to remove it from the engine. I'm gonna go ahead and start the car to see if the power steering pump belt was the belt that was causing the screeching noise. All right, so it looks like it's the alternator belt. So removing the alternator belt is very similar. Loosen the top bolt, you don't have to remove it. Loosen the bolt going through the tensioner block behind the alternator. Push the alternator to release the belt tension and remove the belt. Slide the new belt and route the belt around the pulleys. I made a belt diagram so you guys can pause the video here and check out how the belts are routed. The alternator is referred as a generator. Once you route the belts around the pulleys and you get to the last pulley, use a pry bar to push it onto the pulley. Retighten the bolt tension where you see the clear threads.
Do the same for the power steering pump and you're all done. Alright you guys, if y'all found this video helpful, please select that like button. Thanks for watching you guys. And uh, hopefully this video encourages you or actually helps you replace the belts on the Mazda 626. I know there's not a lot of videos out there for this specific vehicle. But um, yeah, I do plan on doing some mechanic and maintenance work videos on this Mazda. And I only plan on keeping it for one year. And after that, I have to upgrade. I have to upgrade my mechanic mobile. So, yeah, once again, thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Late! <clears throat> yeah, I, I can't, I can't speak so loud or have hella energy. I feel a little sick, a little sick. Sick and tired of my bull****. Nah, I'm just playing. I never get sick and tired of my bull****. Cool. Alright, you guys. Thanks for watching this whole last video. Let's get out of here.